Before you came over, I was thinking, maybe we could just bury her ourselves. What? It'll be cheaper and quicker. Plus, we got this thing to do, and I don't want this screwing things up. You know, it figures. What does? We're about to score some decent money. Money that could really change things for me. And she goes and dies. She's your mother, man. Have some respect. Listen, you got your car, right? Yeah, it's parked on the street. OK, drive it around back. Don't do anything suspicious. Just drive it around, then come inside. What are you going to do? Just do it, all right? All right. Sorry, I've been sort of a fuck up. I'll try to change. I know I can if I just keep trying. Wherever you're going, have a nice trip. Sorry about your mother, man. You okay? I'm okay. You don't look okay. I just never thought she'd die on me like this. How old was she anyway? 52. Next Tuesday was supposed to be her birthday. Were you gonna get her something? I already did. Some mouse traps for the kitchen. You know, she still looks kind of pissed off. Take the next right. Okay, that's deep enough. Maybe you should say a prayer. What should I say? I don't know, she was your mother. Hey man, do you think this would have happened if we hadn't been planning this thing we're gonna do? I mean, maybe God's punishing me. Right now, before we even did it. What are you talking about? Maybe if I would have been around more to help her, she wouldn't have died on us like this. Maybe she'd be at home now, alive, watching TV. But that's bullshit. You did everything you could for her. It's just the way life is sometimes. Yeah? How is it? Completely random and unpredictable. You can't even count on Social Security anymore. Yeah, I heard. You ready? I'm ready. What about Julie? What about her? Is she gonna help us or not? I told you, she never came over. I knew we couldn't trust her. Hey, shut up, all right? It's Max's girlfriend you're talking about. You wanna get something to eat first? I don't think we should be seen in public together. Yeah, you're probably right. Anybody home? See anyone? Not you? No. Okay. Let's do it. Right. Anything? 
No, it's too dark. What exactly are we looking for, anyway? For something that could hold a lot of money. Like what? Like a suitcase or a duffel bag, something bulky. A suitcase? Yeah, or a duffel bag. I hate the dark. What are you, 12? It's just not knowing exactly where the hell I am. Yeah, well, tough, that's life. Hey, this looks like something. It's just a bunch of shoes. Hey man, did your father really work here? Yeah, he did. What happened to him? He retire? No. He didn't retire. His hand got caught in a stitching machine. Got partially mangled. It's a pretty serious injury. He took off for a month. The day he was supposed to come back, the supervisor told him not to come in anymore. After 23 years, the assholes fired him. There's no justice in the world, you know that? Wait a minute. Look at this. It's like a closet with a padlock on it. Open it up. All right. What is it? Looks like a pile of old newspapers with something under it. Go in and get it. Me? You want me to get it? No, the man in the fucking moon. Go ahead. See anything? I see something, man. Bring it out here so I can see it too. Could have told you that was gonna happen. You didn't know anything, Julie. We all thought there was money in there, all right? All right? Whatever. It's a typewriter, man. I can see that. What are we gonna do with a typewriter? I don't know. Type something, I guess. I have an idea if you want to hear it. Anyone want to hear the idea I have? Yeah, what's your idea? You know Mike, my ex-boyfriend? Yeah, we know him. He gets together with three other people every Saturday night for this high-stakes poker game. Yeah, we've heard that, so? So I went with him once, and I saw a shitload of money on the table. Maybe you could go in and get it. How are we gonna do that, Julie? We don't even know how to play poker. Stupid asshole. You don't go in there and play. You get some guns. They don't have to be real. Toy guns. You get some masks. You burst in on the game and you leave with all the money. How much money? I don't know. Five? Ten thousand? You still pissed off at Mike for dumping you. He didn't dump me, all right? I dumped him. That's not what I've heard. Oh, yeah? What did you hear? That he dumped you, which means you're probably still pissed at him. Okay, yeah, I am. Plus, he never paid me back the 400 bucks I loaned him, so I'll just be getting back what he owes me. Where's this game held? First, you gotta agree to give me 10% of anything you get. 10%? What for? Because it was my idea, jerk off. We'll give you five. Uh-uh. Seven. Okay, seven. What's the address? Every Saturday night. Eight o'clock. Could you get that, please? Why should I? It's your pizza. I know, but we're busy here and we'd appreciate it if you could help. So what do you think? I don't know, she's your girlfriend. Not anymore. If you don't eat, you're gonna... Hey. Hey, how you doing? Okay. I've been looking for you all day. Really? How'd you find me? Your friend from the Salvation Army. 
this uh, another friend of yours? Yep, this is George. He'll be all right as long as he eats something. Fucking bastard drivers. Look what they did to me. Could have been worse. You might have been killed. Worse. What could be worse than this? You want to come over tonight? Can't. I'm sort of still busy with that other thing I told you about. You want to try and feed him? He won't take it from me. Go ahead, he won't bite. You sure about that? Yeah, I'm sure about that. George, I, George, that wasn't very polite. I'm so, I'm so sorry about that. It's okay. I'm so, I'm so sorry about what that. What are you worried about? It's just puke. You sure this is a good idea? I wouldn't be sitting here if I didn't. What are we gonna do about that dog? Maybe it won't be here after tonight. Yeah, but maybe it will. So how are we gonna do this? I don't know, it seems pretty simple to me. All we do is go in, take the money at gunpoint, then leave. If we both stay calm, shouldn't be a problem. You ever seen that movie, The Getaway? With Steve McQueen? No, with Alec Baldwin. These guys decide to rob a racetrack. They plan everything out, and they get away with it. But then there's a double cross, and he has to flee to Mexico with Kim Basinger. This is a house, not a racetrack. I know that. The point is, is you can plan everything out, down to the smallest detail, and shit can still happen. Okay, I'll try to remember that. Hey, man, can I ask you a question? Sure, go ahead. When we were in the factory the other day looking for the money, why'd you think it was on the first floor all of a sudden instead of the second? But it wasn't. We didn't find it, remember? You know what I think? I think your father had something to do with that bank robbery somehow. I think he stashed his share of the money in the factory, and you wanted me to help you find it, but not know exactly where it was in case Julie and I wanted to find it without you. You figure that out by yourself, or did Julie help you? By myself. <laughs> You're not thinking of telling anyone, are you? Are you shitting me, man? We're friends. Hands up! Hands up! Get him up! Get him up! I'll blow your fucking head off! I said get your hands up or I'll blow your fucking head off! Huh? What'd you say? What'd you say? What the fuck did you say to me? I said get your hands up! You hear me? Bitch! Dog's barking again. I'm not deaf. You still want to do this? What do you want to do? I think we should seriously consider killing that dog. You know, if we do this and get arrested, we'll probably go to different prisons. Think so? Probably. Prison's pretty bad, you know. Yeah? How bad? First, they humiliate you. Then they beat the shit out of you. And then they fuck you. And that's only the first day. Yeah. Well, I feel like I'm already in prison, so it doesn't matter. Okay. Let's do it. Oh, man. Right. Everybody's yeah. in? Yeah. Let's go. Nothing. 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 Yeah. Look at that. All oh, the flush is you coming along, yeah, kid. Yeah. Uh, Jack Betts. Get my stand. Who the hell is that? It's probably Sully. No, man, he already told me he couldn't make it tonight. No. Oh, I want all the fucking money on the table now! Now! Let's go on the table! 
Wait a minute. Wait a minute. How do we know those guns are real? What the fuck did you just say? Those guns. How do we know they're real? He's got a point, man. You want me to blow his fucking head off? Huh? That's what I'll do right now. Hey, man. Better say something. Do it. Come on! All right. Give him the money. Come on. Come on! Is that everything? Is that everything? Is that it? Yeah, that's it. All right, did anybody recognize them? How could we? They had masks on. Their voices, you douchebag. Did anybody recognize their voices? Fuck! How much is it? 18,655. 18,000? Yeah, 600. Shit. What's wrong? I thought we'd get a lot more. What are you talking about? It's 18 grand. $18,000 and all we had to do was knock on a door and point our guns. Have you ever seen $18,000 in cash before? No, never. What are you gonna do with your share? I don't know, probably buy something with it. Like what? I don't know yet, okay? I don't know. Maybe you could get a new car. Why? What's wrong with my car? I told you. The muffler's all fucked up. There's nothing wrong with my car, all right? All right? Hey, chill out, okay? It's just a suggestion. <sighs> Maybe I should dig up my mom and bury her properly. Give her a funeral, you know? You really think that's a good idea? Maybe I'll buy some paint. Paint? Yeah, paint. What for? For the house. It needs painting. You know, it's funny. Now that we finally have some money, we don't know what the hell to do with it. it seems like everything we needed, we already had. Got any beer? No. Julie drank it all last night. Yeah, that figures. Time's up. I need that rent. I'll pay you tomorrow. Too late. I need it now. What'd you do? Change the locks? That's right. Stand at procedure when you're dealing with deadbeats. What the hell is that? A typewriter. Where'd you get it? You steal it? No, I didn't steal it. Anyway, it's none of your goddamn business. You know, for somebody who don't pay the rent, you got an awful big mouth. Yeah, well, you're a greedy asshole. Oh, yeah? Give me this. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, yeah, take me tomorrow. Give me that to the floor, you greedy asshole. Give me the goddamn key, asshole. Where's the goddamn key, you fuck? Give me the fucking key. Take it easy, yeah. It's the one with the big fucking tip. What the fuck is the matter with you? Fucking moron. Fuck you. Fuck you, too, you fuck. What the fuck is the matter with you? You fucking smack my ribs and fucking head. No. You know where he is? No. Come in. What's going on? I thought you guys broke up. We did. I'm packing some stuff I left here. Did you see this? Carl's moved to California.
you know where his mother is? What? Do you know where Carl's mother is? Where is she usually? Over there, in front of the TV, but she hasn't been there in two days. He did it. Crazy bastard did it. Says I should give you my house key, plus this videotape you've been looking for. So here they are. Uh, you got something for me first? What? My share of the money, that's what. What money? Hey, everybody knows that poker game got robbed, so don't try to bullshit me. It's all over town. It is? Yeah, it is. Don't worry. Nobody knows who did it except me, and I'm not about to tell them. We got 18000 I get 7%. That's... Thirteen hundred, approximately. Thanks. So, I'll see you later, all right? Where are you going now? I got a job at the state, and I start this morning. Say hi to Carl for me. Assuming you ever talk to him again. Hey. Hey. What's going on? Nothing, just having some breakfast. Can I sit down? Sure. I ordered toast, but she brought me burnt English muffins. Maybe you should complain. Yeah, maybe I will. You hungry? No, I have to get to work in a few minutes. I found a new job. Really? Yeah, at the video store. I think I got your friend Carl's job. <laughs> Where is he, anyway? I'm not sure, but I think he moved to California. California? Yeah, that's, that's what he wanted and he got it. Uh, how's George? You get him to eat something finally? Yeah, finally. I'm sorry that he puked on your hand. <sighs> you doing anything later? After work? No. Maybe we could go to the beach and, and hit some balls again. Okay. Yeah. I have to get to that job. Listen. As of today, I'm living in this house. It's sort of shabby but it's got two bedrooms and a trailer. Maybe we could figure something out. Yeah. That might work. See you later. Miss? Yes. Never mind. Baby 